Hello everybody and welcome back to Yelan app. In this video I'm going to be reviewing the Huawei GT5 Pro watch. So as you can see they actually do have two a complete different design of that specific watch. So they do have this specific design but they, but they also have a little bit slimmer version of the design. And I think that this one right here is probably meant for men and this one is made for females. But of course if you're a man and like this watch or if you're a female and like this watch like there's no problem of course but i think this is just standard that this one is for men and female basically so as you can see this one right here this specific design of the watch comes in two different different colors so you have the bl uh, black color right here but you also have like a gray color as you can see so this one uh it says it's a black color as you can see and this color is actually titanium and for this one right here you get the white color as you can see and you get the ceramic white as well as you can see which i think this one uh, for my liking this color seems to be the best in my opinion and the black one for this one i like the i like the most to be completely honest with you but this uh, watch in general and this one right here has pretty cool design so as you can see it is different measure measurements so this one right here is a bit slimmer and this one is a bit bigger as you can see and you can see that in the measurements right here they also actually list the measurements right here so you can see so that you can check out and see if this is something that is very important for you of course the wrist size right here as you can see we're able to view the wrist size and the wrist size for this one and just to clarify they're going to of course give you the details for this clock on this road right here and details for this clock on this road right here just so it's it's easier for you to follow along as well of, of course the watch strap as you can see you're able to view the wh what kind of watch strap they have as you can see this is the black version and the, the black color version for this uh, specific watch strap as you can see and you have the titanium here as well as you can see and you, they also like explain for this other watch as well what kind of actually watch strap that they have so if this is something that is very important for you so then just double check of course as you can see they also list out the weight this one as you can see is 53 grams this one is 44 g as you can see right here so they don't weigh the same of course we're going to keep scrolling down right here you're also able to view the resolution as you as you can see and that one seems to be almost the same this one as you can see has the 326 ppi as you can see and this one has 352 ppi instead so they do actually differ in that kind of resolution right here as you can see a little bit so we're going to scroll down I think that the sensors right here as you can see they have a for example an optimal optical heart rate sensor right here as you can see as an example they have a temperature sensor and a lot more sensors right here as well so this one right here if it's important for you then make sure to double check this one right here as well and by the way this one seems to be for both those clocks so if this is only one as you can see it's not written right here it's only written right here and i guess that means that it's for both clocks in F, like also double check of course but i guess that that must be the case as you can see a uh, charging port is wireless charging as you can see system requirements is android 9.0 or later or ios 13.0 or later as you can see it, it does have some waterproof level as you can see so double check that as well we're going to keep scrolling down it is supported the nfc tag is supported as you can see bluetooth as well as you can see right here which is awesome speaker as you can see is supported microphone is also supported as you can see and battery life as you can see for those different clocks right here it does have different battery life as you can see so if you're going to uh, buy this clock right here this version of the clock then as you can see seven day battery life for maximal usage five day battery life for regular usage as, as you can see or three day battery life with always on display enabled so this is also good to be able to know of course so we're going to keep scrolling down and that is it for the specification so this is basically my review for these two clocks right here.